Hello, this is uh, John from Agtooth again, and this clutch is a female genetic stripe head albino bred to a super tiger um, platinum motley lavender mouthful. So, anyways, the this this egg is just pipped here, and we're gonna cut these open and see how we did. You see a little tongue flick on this guy already. He's definitely got motley in him. And we know he has tiger in him. Not sure about the, the platinum. Obviously he's not an albino. And let's see if we get this egg here. This one definitely appears to be albino. Let's see. Hopefully it's all right. Yeah, it's about to, oh, what is that? It looks like a mini Charlie. Uh, could be white or lavender. And oh, I guess it is okay. It just poked its head back in. Got mm -hmm. a big yolk sack in there. One of the first albinos out of the clutch probably should get you know roughly half albino out of this. And we could get a little bit of everything with the male being lavender albino. So you know we could get labs, whites, maybe even purples. Definitely motley. We know they're all tigers for sure, because it was a super tiger male. So it's definitely tiger and uh, motley. Not sure about the platinum. This egg. another albino of some kind I would say that that's a white albino and it's definitely tiger and I and I think motley too so I'll put that back down it was a good clutch but not a big clutch 18 eggs roughly one of them didn't make it Well, it might be able to confirm the platinum, though. Beautiful. It definitely looks platinum. Yeah. I would think that they would all... I mean, they're dominant genes, so I think they would all get them. No comment going on in the chair. Beautiful. Assume as a white or a lab. Very pretty, I know that. Mm -hmm. oh, cool. Ooh. I do love the motley. It's probably really Holding on to a few of these for yeah, pullbacks. Maybe make some super mountains eventually. Another 
Motley. Motley Tiger. It almost looks like maybe this isn't platinum, and that is. Mm -hmm. of the but they look a whole lot different than they will in a couple weeks from now when they shed and stuff. Oops, sorry, guy. Look at that. I like that mm -hmm. pattern. Beautiful. It's always fun cutting eggs. It's just like Christmas to us. Mm -hmm. I have to get my finger in here to make sure I don't cut them. Another beautiful Motley. I'm really excited about that. Haven't produced Motley before. We haven't we haven't produced a lot of stuff today actually. We had the cows for the first. Mm -hmm. mm. Oh, looks like another albino. I think they're either white or labs. Interesting. I haven't seen anything for sure lab or for sure purple. Either white or lab so far. This over here. Oh, no, no. Man, this egg's heavy. Chunky mm -hmm. one. Someone had some yolk. Mm -hmm. These eggs were literally the cl two clutches were laid within a day of each other. The golden cow cow clutch and this this clutch here. So far, this is pretty good numbers in the albinos. Mm -hmm. She's been a great mom. She's, she's like her fourth clutch. She's not a big girl. Genetic stripe is usually not, but she always says just really good eggs, like no slugs. Mm. Not a lot, but what she does have is really good. Be crazy straight. <laughs> no, my son talking about crazy stripes. It's one of our old backs we have that we call it crazy stripe. It's, I think it's just a super tiger, but it looks so much different than our regular one. It looks really cool. Probably have to do a video with him someday. And another albino. I think the whites stay the truth. They're cool, I like it. Mm -hmm. really interesting. These eggs are interesting because they, they seem to go full term, but with this weird shape on the bottom. So we'll see what we get here. I'm, I'm hoping they're fine. They, they look okay, except for that weird spot on the bottom, you know? The weird shaped egg. Oh, wow, look at the stripe Whoa, on that. That is, that is really cool. That is sick. I love that. Wow. Soon there's going to be a couple holdbacks on this. Jeez. 
Well, we're gonna keep some, aren't we? Anyway. I bought that one. Mm -hmm. yeah, well, we'll be we'll be picking them out. Got the goo there. Okay, so we got one more egg here. So let's see. We got one, two, three, four, five. We got six albinos so far. And the rest look like Montley Tiger and Montley Tiger Platinum with some. But really, they really don't brighten up until they have their first shed. And they're not going to shed for another you know, 10 to 14 days and then I'll try to get them eating. I don't like to ship them out until they've eaten at least two or three times. Oh. We'll be in Brunswick, Georgia soon because of the python ban, you know. I had to uproot everyone in my family, unfortunately. Uh, FWC even talked about euthanizing our animals, so I couldn't do that. But anyways, we in Brunswick, and this is another, looks like another beautiful clutch. And uh, we'll be showing you some more update videos soon, um, as far as when they're ready to go. And, you know, after they shed, they're going to look a whole lot better and different, but... Anyways, thanks for watching, and we should have some new videos soon.